Hello guys, uh, this is Shaw and uh, in this video I will show you how you can get the navigation bar on your Drydebox T8S Plus. Well, uh, the Drydebox T8S Plus as you know has the Android Lollipop version of operating system on it and um, usually our users when they use the T8S box or the T8 box they saw the status bar at the bottom of the screen of their uh, of the TV or their monitor so they saw the status bar but in this lollipop version uh, they don't see any status bar and there have been um, emails and there have been requests from users as to how they can get the navigational bar on their Drydebox T8S Plus so I tried to do it on my box and uh, finally I got to a stage where I tried um, app apps from outside sources and I found an app from within Play Store which works pretty fine. Uh, there are lots of apps but uh, with Android Lollipop version um, I'm not sure uh, because I tried a lot of them and they did not work uh, except this one that I have installed. You can see there is one uh, red icon on the, bar, uh, on the top left corner here where you can see my cursor. So if I click on this you can see you can see there is a home button, there is a back button, there is the recent apps and uh, the alarm and, and, uh, and the lock. So mostly users want to use the home button and the back button. So, so it is uh, available in this application and it works pretty well like if I go into my uh, if I go into my apps here I'm inside my apps and now if I want to go back and if I click on this um, navigation bar tool, navigation bar icon, it gives all these apps, all these options and if I click on home or if I click on back it will take me back to the home screen. I will click on home and it takes me back to the home screen. So and plus like if I go on to here on the home screen, if I go on to Play Store here, if I click on Play Store, I'm right now inside my Play Store and then if I click on this app, uh, this icon on the uh, top left corner, I click on it, it gives me all these options, uh, click on back, uh, here I click on back and you see I go on to the back, uh, I go back to the home screen. So a pretty useful app, you can install it from uh, from Play Store, uh, so I will just go ahead and uninstall this and then I will show you how you can install it. So I will just go ahead in my more settings and then I will go on to apps and okay just a minute okay uh, where is this app okay you can see navigation bar here I'm going to click on it and then click for stop and click OK and then after I click OK I will go ahead and clear data so I'm clearing data okay and then I will go ahead and click uninstall right now so I'm clicking uninstall and this is uninstalled as of now so I will just go back to the home screen and then I will go into Play Store here you go this is the Play Store the shopping bag icon click OK and you are inside Play Store and then I will search for uh, navigation navigation uh, and navigation bar uh, click OK and it is searching you can see the first tab it shows the navigation bar that we are using so I will click on it uh, okay I'm clicking on it and then I will go and hit install on the on the right side so I'll click install it shows me this accept button I will click accept and you can see it is downloading and uh, okay it's downloading and almost done and you can see it's installing now so it shows me to open it. I will open it. You can also go back to the home screen and then go into your apps and you will find the navigation bar in your apps here. So navigation bar is in here. I will go into navigation bar and then you can, you can see to use app you must enable accessibility. You will click OK here. So I'm clicking OK and it takes me to the accessibility option and you will turn on the navigation bar at the top. Click on it and then turn it on here on the top right 
click on this and you can see it gives you use navigation bar click OK and it has turned on the navigation bar here you can see it is on now so navigation bar is on and I'm going back uh, you can see now uh, I'm inside the app uh, show uh, which is navigation bar and it has all these options here so what we will do is we will first option is show virtual navigation bar we'll click on it and turn it on so you can see the navigation bar has appeared on the uh, top left corner and you can the next option is start on boot we'll also turn this on on the right side okay toggle it on okay so it's on now so both of these um, uh, both of these uh, should be on so that whenever you restart your device it will automatically pop up on the screen and uh, uh, this one should also be on show virtual navigation bar so that's it um, how you can enable the navigation bar on your T8S Plus so rest of the settings you can check out but um, I use with all, only these two settings that I changed and it worked pretty well so if I go back to the home screen you can see the navigation bar is on the top left corner if I click on it it gives me all these options so if you are looking for the navigation bar that's how you do it okay take care cheers for now bye bye